Hey there, Stan Arthur at the controls here and again cruising the Adobe Premiere Pro forum and I saw this post by Neffel777, a holy number. And uh, after reading this paragraph right here, I think that what you're missing is how to export the work area only. And I'm going to just uh, demonstrate that for you real quick. I'm going to take this clip here, which is quite long clip, hour, hour and a half, or something like that. I'm going to drop it into a new sequence. And let's see, indeed it is uh, oh, look at that an hour and 46 minutes long and uh, let's say I just wanted to take as you said you want to take this uh, like a two minute portion of something that has a, something on the left track and a different portion on the right track of audio and you just want that so I'm gonna set my work area to the beginning point that I want just move it down a little bit this is just for demonstration purposes and uh, set my work area to just the thing that I want now I'm gonna go up to a uh, file export media and wait for it there we go pops right up for me now, I don't want to ex you don't you want just the audio so I'm gonna uncheck export video I'm gonna make sure that under source range here that work area is selected and then all I have to do is hit um, uh, well let's name it something and sh make sure it's going to the right directory by clicking here uh, if we go to I'll just leave it in this little tutorials fo folder but let's name it uh, my audio clip and uh, we're going to do that and then just wait for it to export uh, it's going to bring up Adobe Media Coder, export it and uh, and now they've got a, a media, media encoder up, I just hit uh, the little export button there, wait for it and now it's done exporting, now we're just going to import it uh, from the folder that we saved it to which was uh, tutorials, right? So hang on Go find that real quick. Tutorials, tutorials. There it is. And uh, my audio clip, AVI. It says AVI, but it's audio only. Uh, it's it, it'll work just fine. If you can see, there it is. And first few years, you show up. Okay, now you indicated that it was a left channel, right channel issue, that like there's music on one side and, and, and audio you want to use on another side. Well, just for fun, I'm going to drop this into a new sequence uh, and demonstrate to you how uh, I would deal with that. If, if I drop this, this, this clip that I want in here and I want just the left track, then I would go to uh, my effects and just type in fill and if I want the the music that's on the left track then I would take this little effect here called fill left and drop it in there now whatever's on the right track is not going to play only what was on the left track is going to play on the left and right channel simultaneously uh, and I can do the same thing with fill right if I want the 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 uh, audio portion that's on the right track. If I hit f take fill right and drop that in there, then whatever's on the left track will not play, but what's on the right track will play in, on the left and right channels simultaneously. Boy, I hope that answers your question. If it doesn't, let me know. I'll try something else. Thanks.